Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As most viewers who watch this video can see, we have a slightly different format right now. I usually do these standing up. Unfortunately, I have the flu at the moment, and candidly, I can't get through one of these videos without almost passing out. It's, it's, it's not great. So I'm doing these sitting down. Hopefully by next week, I will be back up on my feet, so please just bear with me. That said, we are talking about, as the title of this video suggests, we're talking about K-1 fiancé visas. For those who are unaware, K-1 visa is a visa that allows the fiancé of an American citizen to travel to the United States for the purposes of getting married and thereafter adjusting status to green card status. <coughs> Excuse me. Question posed in this video, though, is what is, what is the timing requirement in terms of the relationship to be able to apply for a K-1 visa? And a lot of people get confused by this, what's called a two-year meeting requirement. And I've, I've had a couple of people in the last couple of weeks ask me this question, so I figured, you know what, a clarification video on this is probably a good idea. Basically, the question posed is, do I have to be together with her for a full two years before I can file for a K-1 visa? No, that's not what the requirement says. What the requirement says is you must have met each other physically in person within two years prior to the filing of a petition for a K-1 fiancé visa in order for it to meet the eligibility criteria. And there are other criteria, but that is a big one, the two-year meeting requirement. So, Yes, there's a requirement that you have met within two years, but it's not a requirement that you have a relationship which has a duration of two years at the point at which you file. So a big difference between those two things. So again, it's the meeting requirement. You simply have to have met each other in person within two years, not have had a relationship for the entirety of a two-year period before filing for a K-1 fiancé visa.